Uh, this video is on area of a triangle um, and specifically right angle triangles. So these are a little bit um, complicated and have been causing some issues in Mathletics. So I'm going to show you what values to use. Um, in this, um, for a right angle triangle, right angle triangle, sorry, use the height and the length, but not the hypotenuse. And give me a second. So this value, this value, where the box points to, don't use this value. This value is known as the hypotenuse. Okay, formulas we use are um, area equals 0.5, area can equal a half by length by height, and area can, can equal length by height divided by 2. They all mean the same thing. Use the formula that you feel comfortable with. Uh, this is an example. So in this example, the height is 24 millimeters and the length is 10 millimeters. So my working, I redrew it out in my exercise book. Um, length, and I labeled the height and the length. And I didn't use the hypotenuse, which is 26 millimeters. Um, I applied the area of a triangle formula and I got 120 millimeters. And to prove that, I will do it on a calculator in front of you. 24 multiplied by 10 divided by 2, and we get 120 millimeters squared. Cool. Um, I'm going to do another example for you. Okay, so we're calculating the area. So 15 centimeters is the hypotenuse in this case. We're not using it. We're only using the length and the height. Um, once again, I redrew this triangle in my exercise book. So I said the length was 9 centimeters and I said the height was 12 centimeters. I applied the formula 12 times 9 times a half and I got 54 centimeters. And to show you that this works on a calculator, where is my calculator? There we go. 12 times 9 times 0.5 equals 54. You could also do 12 multiplied by 9 and then divide that by 2 and you'll get 54 centimeters squared. Um, I hope this helps. Jacob.